Oh, welcome, Wolf of Wolfettes. We are back with a brilliant house flipper on the PlayStation 4 Pro. And in the last video, I did the guest room. Now, as you know, the grandparents have got three gang... Uh, I nearly said gay children. Three, three grandchildren. They might be gay, I don't know. Three grandchildren. They've got uh, Bob, Gary and Amy. So their guest room needs to accommodate three children. But at the same time, when the grandkids are not staying here, there's going to be other family members that are going to use the guest room as well. So this is the guest room that I have built. And as you can see, it is very, very, very old people themed. And I think it looks absolutely phenomenal. Probably one of the best rooms I've made so far, I reckon, besides that fantastic sauna. But look at that though. We've got a bed over here that Gary and Bob can use. We've also got a little bed over here that Amy can use. They've both got bedside tables where they've got little drawers so they can keep their Nintendo consoles in. Or if you're, if you're feeling fancy, you might have a PlayStation Vita. But we all know that Sony don't make games for the Vita no more because they're a bunch of bastards. So uh, there you go. You've got your bedside table for all of your mobile phones and consoles and that. Uh, a nice little light and stuff so you can uh, play your consoles at night without hurting your eyes. Obviously an alarm clock because they might need to get out for school. Then they've got a cupboard for their clothes, a bookcase over here. And this is where grandma sits when the kids are misbehaving or if she's going to read them a book or if maybe one of the kids are feeling ill. Then she sits in that chair and, you know, tends to the grandkids. So there you go. And we've got this beautiful Witcher 3 poster on the wall as well. Very nice. And also they've got a couple of pictures of holidays they went on. So uh, that's the guest room. We didn't really do much with the bathroom. We just put a mirror in here and a horrible, horrible rug. But there you go, that's the bathroom as well. And you've already seen the sauna, but there you go. So I think what we're gonna do now is we are gonna work on grandma and grandpa's, um, I really need to fix this, it's starting to piss me off. But we're gonna work on their, um, on their bedroom. I'm not gonna, I feel like I need to put a, I feel like I need to put a door on here, don't I? Right, let me just quickly buy a door. Um, but we're going to be working on their bedroom today and I think I've got quite a good idea of what I want it to look like. But um, first things first, what was we doing? Ah, we're buying the door, aren't we? Got to make sure I get the right colour door. This one, innit? Yep, lovely. Right, so we want to make sure that this opens. There we go. It provides a bit of protection as well, because uh, as there's no handrail or anything, and uh, grandma and grandpa are pretty old, so there's a good chance they could fall this way and die. So by having the door come out like this, it provides a little bit of security, you know, whilst they get their foot in. Because if, you know, if, she, if she falls here, then she's just going to land there, so it's not, it's not too bad, you know. She might survive. Same with grandpa, but, you know, that door might save their life one day. Okay, we are going to do some stuff with the garage, but not too much. We're going to build a couple of, like, maybe a workbench, maybe some, like, tool racks, put some tools around and stuff like that so Grandpa can work on his uh, Ford Fiesta. But other than that, we're not going to do too much with the garage. Right, here's the bedroom. Now, I'm not sure if I can do this, but I've had this idea since I bought the house, but I don't know if you can place anything outside at all. But um, I did see a rocking chair. Let's see if we can pl Oh, look! It rocks! Nice little animation there. Right, obviously we're going to make it wooden. Oh, come on, game! You've got the flipping garden flipper DLC. You should let me play stuff outside. Oh, well. Okay, right. So we're going to get one of these bad boys anyway, because, uh... Grandpa, uh... Obviously, Grandpa Teddy he was in the war, you know, so he's got a lot of wartime memories. And you know, it's when you've been in the, when you've been in the war, it can be quite stressful, you know, shooting people and shit. Uh, especially when you don't necessarily want to, you just got to look after your country. So uh, sometimes he likes to sit in his rocking chair and slowly. <laughs> he likes to sit in his rocking chair with the uh, garden door open, with a slight breeze coming through, going through his grey beard, and he likes to rock back and forth with his pipe. Just thinking about his war days, you know. He likes to reminisce about his war days. And uh, sometimes he gets a little bit worked up and wonders if he is actually a bad guy. But we all know you're not a bad guy, Grandpa Teddy. You are a top bloke. But uh, I already know the bed I'm going to get for this room. 
I think. I might change it, I might might get something else, but I think I've got a good idea of what bed I want. Where is it? It's like it's got like bear skins on it. Oh yeah, look, there we go. Actually no, I'm not I'm not too sure. I don't think I think I think Grandpa Teddy would probably like that bed, but I think if Grandma saw that, she would she'd probably she'd probably kill him. She'd probably whack him. She'd probably hire some of the gangsters, the local gangsters to whack him for her. So I don't really think we can buy that for the bedroom because I think Grandma Gladys will lose her mind, so yeah, I, I, sorry Grandpa Teddy, you can't have your uh, bare skin looking bed. You can have, what would Grandma want? <coughs> what would Grandma want? Oh, she's gonna want, oh, she's not having that, that's for sure. She is not having that. <laughs> is that a, that's a single bed. I feel like we might need to stick with this one over here. That's too elegant for old people, isn't it? How about this bad boy? Look at that, that looks pretty good, doesn't it? What about the bedding? Oh, there we go. Oh, no, no, not that. No, it's, it's got to be the middle one, isn't it? It's got to, it's, if it doesn't have some sort of flower on it, don't buy it. Oh, look at that, it's pretty small as well, because you know when you get old, you start to shrivel up, don't you? As you've probably seen, when you were like a little kid, like you get older, like you start off as a kid obviously, and you're really short, and then you see your grandparents and they're pretty tall. And as you get older, uh, you feel like you're so much taller, but you're not. What actually happens is your grandparents shrink. It's kind of true actually. My granddad was, uh, I think he was like, I think he was the same height as I am, like probably like six foot one. And uh, he, like when I saw him last, obviously before the bad shit happened, but when I saw him, uh, he, he, how much he shriveled up? He must be like five foot 10 now. Or something like that. You like you really shrivel up, and obviously you start hunching over, don't you? So your grandparents always end up shrinking. So this is this is a nice size bed. It does look pretty small, doesn't it? Okay, I'm not going to put them right next to the radiator just because you know they, they might burn themselves. Right, we're going to need to get a bedside table, obviously. We'll get this one. It's a little bit different. What colour do we want to make it? Not cherry. Maybe maybe pine, I guess. We'll have to see if the other furniture can match it. Oh, no, 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 we've got to make that darker. That's better. <laughs> I could have picked the other one, it would have looked horrible. Right, so we're going to put this here right next to the bed. Obviously we're gonna to have to get some sort of lamp on this bad boy. So let's have a look for the lamps. I think I already know what I'm gonna buy, it's very obvious. There we go, a stylite. That is not stylized. oh shit. Oh, look at that, Woo! Oh, here we go, that matches the bed, doesn't it? Has that got polar bears on it? We might have to go with that instead. There we go. What the hell kind of style was this? Stylized ceramic. That looks like shit. It looks like this lamp has been rotting in a Roman ruin for years and they've just dug it up and for some reason it still works and for some reason it has electricity. Nah. What's the matter with the bottom of it? What is this piece of shit, right? We're gonna make it, we're gonna have to make it white anyway. Woo, that's a big one, isn't it? Obviously I wanna put it in the middle, but Oh, we're gonna put it in the middle. I did want to, um, I did want to place something else on that, but we're gonna to have to get like a, we're gonna get like a, a chest of drawers, probably over here. I feel like it's gonna stick out a bit too much, but they just won't be able to use this door anymore. They're gonna to have to only open this door. <laughs> You're only gonna have one side open at a time anyway. You can't have both sides open unless you smash the window. Right, let's get ourselves. A chest of drawers. So if we just search for chest, it should come up. Hopefully. No, chunky Lappy just came up then. Oh, oh, look at this. I think that's going to be a bit too long, isn't it? Let's have a look. 
it's gonna be too long. Oh no, 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 it might just about. Oh, look at that, oh, look at that. And it's not too big as well. I don't really like the flowers on it. What do you think? That looks all right, actually. That looks pretty damn good. And then at the same time, you've got grandma's side. Actually, no, 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 no. Grandpa's side of the bed has to be this side because if grandpa is like me, um, I always have to sleep on the side closest to the door because I always feel like if a robber ever comes into the house, breaks into my house, obviously, and they try to come into my room, I would rather be the first person that they see. So if they do decide to kill someone with, a, with an axe, it'll be me that dies instead of my partner. So, um, yeah, I always sleep on the side closest to the door. So obviously, Grandpa's probably being a war veteran, he's probably gonna be the same as me. So he's gonna sleep on this side of the bed. But uh, then he gets access to the lamp as well, so that's good. And then sometimes he's gonna get up in the night when he's had a few nightmares about his war, war times, and he's gonna sit in this rocking chair, give it a little, give it a little rock. And then he's gonna, if anyone does come through that door, he's gonna be sitting here with his, uh, he might have a gun, who knows. I wonder if there is guns in this game. We'll have to have a look. I think there might be guns you could put on the wall. But what we're going to have on here, we are going to have a couple of things, actually. We're going to have a couple of things. We're going to have... That's it. We're going to have a hair dryer, just a basic hair dryer. We're going to leave this up on here. Doesn't really need to be on here, but we're gonna we're gonna leave it up on here. I don't know where to place it. We'll place it over here. Let me search if there's any like makeup. <laughs> Matey. <laughs> you can see how much I say matey to everyone. I don't want a coffee maker. Who wants a coffee maker? No one not nobody on my channel drinks coffee. We all drink tea, right? It's it's kind of a, a rule. If you're, if you're subscribed to me and you're drinking coffee, we might have a few issues. We might have a few issues. I might have to reconsider whether you're actually part of the pack or not. Because, no, you can't, you can't drink coffee. But what I'll, the main thing that I bought this uh, chest of drawers for is because I wanted to have a bunch of pictures on it. Like a bunch of like, actual, like our cat whiskers and all that. Here we go, look. Framed photo of woman. It's a bit pervy, isn't it? What's she look like? She got a bicycle helmet on and a pair of sunglasses. What a good way to hide the identity. This could be a picture of grandma in her younger days. Before she become an old granny. Like she's always been a baker, but uh, obviously as she's gotten older, she's become a, a weed cookie baker. But you know, you've got to do what you've got to do to survive, ain't you? That's normally the reason why most people become drug dealers, not because it was their literally their job choice. Like, I don't think there's any person that's a drug dealer that's woke up one day and gone, Daddy, you know what I want to be when I get older? I want to be a drug dealer. No, obviously they don't. So it's just, it's just, it just happens, I guess. You just get in with the wrong crowd or whatever. Or you need money. A framed photo of a butterfly. Now, who doesn't want a picture like that? This is a picture that Amy took, because we all know Amy, she goes to art class, and she draws really fantastic pictures of ponies. She also likes to take pictures as well. So she took a picture of a butterfly. It's her favourite picture in the world. That's a pretty damn good picture, Amy. Good job. And then we're also going to have a picture of the cat whiskers, because even though it's not Grandma's cat, she still loves the family cat whiskers, because who doesn't love whiskers? Look at that. Right, what do we want to put right in this spot right here? Something that Grandpa would want. Because Grandpa obviously doesn't get what he wants, because none of us men get what we want. We have to pretty much become slaves to our wives. So uh, we don't really get what we want, so we have to just take what we can get. So, uh, what's Grandpa going to have on here? Is there any pipes in this game? Just like smoking pipes. I don't think there's going to be. Shit! <laughs> uh... I'm just gonna write man and see what comes up. <laughs> Massage. That must have been when I played uh, Mr. Massage or whatever that game was. Oh my god, that was a funny game. 
It's a, it's a game, it was made by the I, uh, My Name is Mayo people. It's another stupid game, but it's funny. But if I write woman, there's a lot of results. If there is, then this game is bloody sexist. Oh no, just a frame fight. Okay, good, 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 right. Oh, let's go on other. Actually, I've got an idea. Oh, come on, why are there guns? Oh, look, there's vases and stuff. Oh, look at that. <laughs> Bloody folks. It's random little things you want. Look at the. So they've got literally like flipping 200 different colours of boxes, but they won't give me anything like a gun. I swear there was guns in this game. Oh, look at that. Yeah, here we go. What are these books about? Ancient civilizations, the rare plants, classic book, deep psychology. Oh, oh. Feel like I've been going through that. Uh. We need to get a wicker laundry basket, don't we? Lovely. Actually, I know. We we're just going to put a vase there. I can't have that one little spot. It just it bothers me. I can put a wok there, I guess. Oh, we, we could put a book there. Maybe a book of rare plants, because, you know, gran when, uh, when Grandpa wakes up at night because he's had his nightmares about the war, he can sit in his rocking chair and then he's got his book over here. A book of uh, rare plants, because, you know, he's, he's obviously been trained in that kind of stuff, because you probably get basic survival training, what to do if you're out in the forest, because if you get behind enemy lines and you're trapped out there and you can't contact your platoon and you've got no supplies, you've got to have basic knowledge on how to start a fire, you've got to be able to, you know, hunt for food, uh, be able to find edible flowers and all that good stuff. So Grandpa probably just wakes up and reads that book, you know, because it's all it's good to know that stuff anyway. We should all know shit like that. Like I, I know how to make a fire. I know about and I know some edible things, but that's just from that's from all of the survival stuff I watched. And I used to be in the um, what are they called, you know, Cub Scouts, Beavers, and all that. I was in that for a few years when I was a kid. And then I got loads of badges quicker than all my friends. Then I ranked up too quick, and then I got put into a new class with nobody I knew, so now I stopped going. Because <laughs> fuck that, mate. Fuck that. I, I wish I didn't rank up. It was horrible. It was like I just did so well. I got all these badges. I wrote a bloody big essay about frogs, because at the time I was liking Frogger, and I liked all the different colour frogs. wrote a big essay about frogs, so I got a badge for doing that. I uh, can't remember what all the badges were for. There was one for doing like some obstacle course thing at this place we went to. I'm, I'm definitely, I'm, I'm, I definitely belong in the outdoors. Um, I think we need to get a dressing table. I know there isn't any wardrobe in here, but I, I guess they can, they could keep most of their clothes in. Mm, not really. I suppose they can keep their, look, look they're just going to have to use the wardrobe in the basement, right? Because we need to get grandma a dressing table, because like I said, she's very glamorous. All right, we're not going to get that one. Ugh. Oh, dear. I, I, I guess that works. What kind of chair are we gonna put there? I'm gonna have to actually give, um, I'm gonna actually give grandma a proper chair because in our other property, uh, I didn't get a proper chair because uh, pretty much the husband was a beautician and he was gonna do his wife's makeup for her every day. But obviously grandpa Teddy can't be leaning down with his bad back doing grandma Gladys's makeup all the time. So we're gonna have to actually get her a chair and she's gonna have to do it herself. There we go, that'll do, won't it? There we go, it's just, just, a, just a random chair. Wedge. 
right? Oh, which is fuck. I don't know why. She's gonna have to go with Cherry, I guess. Am I in the white? There we go. Beautiful. I think that looks. I mean, that that that's room in the room that is, but never mind. <laughs> right now, what do we want to put on the dressing table? I'm gonna leave the uh, I'm gonna leave the the um, the hairdryer there because if any if any robbers decide to try and come in at night and rob the uh, rob the family, then they might accidentally think that that's a ray gun, so they might decide not to rob the house. So we might as well leave that alone. Uh, what else do we want to put in here? I don't, I don't really know. There's not. I didn't really live. I didn't give them. I should have given them. I should have gave them the guest room because there's a lot more room. Obviously, I've still got to do the rugs and all that stuff and the pictures on the wall. Um, let's have a look at the wardrobe, see if there is one that's like small. Just a little one. Because grandma and grandpa probably don't have many clothes. They're not going to need a ton of clothes, are they? It's not like they go out clubbing all the time where they need to make sure they've got different clothing so nobody in the club's like, oh my god. You wore that outfit last time. We don't. They're not going to have to deal with anything like that, are they? So they probably wear the same like jumper and top all the time. That's going to be too oh, fucking up. I suppose I could move the. Um, let me move the dressing table over. Let me just stick it here for a minute. I'm gonna get a different chair because that doesn't fit the room and it's actually starting to piss me off. Actually physically making me annoyed. <laughs> Every time I look at it, I just thought I could feel the sweat drip down my back like that does not match. Okay, right. Getting a bit cramped in here. It's getting a bit bloody... It's getting a bit bloody cramped in here, isn't it? Not too bad though. Obviously, once you put the rug down, that's when the room is complete. That's what you need to do. We need like another oblong one. Right, let's get another chair, and then we'll get another rug, and then we'll start doing the pictures on the wall. And then grandma and grandpa's bedroom will be complete. And then next time, it will be focusing on the living room, and probably on the kitchen as well, I don't know. I'm not going to do too much with the living room, but I've got a very good idea of how I'm going to position everything. It's gonna hopefully going to look pretty good. We have to spend quite a bit of time on the kitchen, though, because... Grandma's going to be very busy in that kitchen, isn't she, Wolf and Wolfette? She's going to be very busy. Did I even press? Yeah, I, have to, I always have to make sure I press record because there's been a few times lately that I've started recording without pressing record. <laughs> I also need to get another external hard drive because there's no room left on my PC again. And I did get myself a bunch of space after uh, finding a spare mini one gigabyte external hard drive. But... Um, I've, uh, I've run out of room again because I was doing 60 FPS. Not one gigabyte, 100 gigabyte, I should say. Flipping out one gigabyte, I won't be, I won't even be able to put one video on that. Right, what, what chair did I just get for her? It needs to be able to be brown. about that? Gilbert. Nope, not the right colour. That might be alright. Black might be a bit better. Yeah, I think black's all right. That suits a bit better than that cherry one, I think. Okay, right, now that's fine, an oblong rug. Yeah, that's a lot better, that one. I mean, the Gentart family said they love wooden furniture. They also like rugs, and they also like pictures on the wall, and they're not even in the bloody list. Bunch of gits, right. I thought I saw a spider on my wall. <laughs> I had a little bit of a panic then. Right, we want the oblong one, but we don't want to use that same one again. We don't want to really use that one. How about this? And I know you're probably looking at that thinking that looks like arse, but that's the, that's the entire point. And then we 
can put another one over here. Oh look, the Jantar, I'm very happy about that. <laughs> God, the Jantar family lost their mind when I placed that down, didn't they? They were like, fuck yes. Oh, 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 oh no, look at that, that's disgusting. Oh, look at that, that brings the room together, doesn't it? That solidus solidifies this room as old people. This is going to mess with Grandpa's rocking chair. You ain't going to be able to rock when the leg is like right on the edge of that rug. And these rugs are quite a Jantar family of third now. They're like, fucking yeah, rugs! God, they really like rugs, don't they? <laughs> Alright, now all we need to do is a couple of pictures on the wall. And Grandma and Grandpa's bedroom is a finito. And next time we can focus on the living room. Right. Let's have a look then. What are we looking for? Just some decorations, innit? Why does the mirrors go? Oh, look at that. Grandpa will like this, wouldn't he? I feel like we should get this. Chill out in your man cave. Just because there used to be a man cave in this house. But we're going to have to place it over here because uh, it's out of the way. This is, this is Grandpa's only corner of the house. This is the only area that Grandpa has anymore. Oh, look! The Jantar family are second! Either way, we win. If the Johnson family buy it, we're technically selling this house to Johnson family Grandma. So, technically, we did sell it to the right woman. And if the Jantar family buy it, then we've sold it to Grandma and Grandpa. So, either way, we win. <laughs> Just the random things you can bloody interact with. Mirror Shannon. I hope there ain't no Karen mirrors. We ain't gonna buy no Karen mirror. What the hell is that? Is that a mirror with a bunch of hooks on it? That's pretty damn cool. That's pretty damn good, actually. Yeah, we could, we, we could probably get one of these bad boys. Hmm. Ah, nah, no, nah, never mind, nah. That's, nah, never mind. Maybe if we didn't have the dressing table. Right, don't forget, we can't get any flowery looking uh, pictures on the wall because it might let the uh, police know that we bake the good stuff in this house. So uh, we're trying to avoid all flowery pictures. Obviously, every piece of furniture, carpet, uh, bed has got flowers on it, but never mind. That, that, they won't notice. Photo power. Of the sea. That looks a little bit like Scarborough, that does. If any of you guys or girls live in England, especially if you're up in the north of England, uh, go to Scarborough in North Yorkshire. It's uh, There isn't a ton of stuff to do in terms of like going out clubbing and all that kind of crap. It, this is a place where you go to be calm and at peace. It's uh, it's definitely a, a, the, kind, the kind of place old people would love. Look at the size of these pictures. They're puny. I want something like big. Doesn't look like there's any flowers in this one. This one might be all right. Oh, that's it. That's what we need. Bit colourful. Oh, look at that. That brings the room together, doesn't it? Man, someone needs to hire me. Come on, hire me. Give me a, a million pound in the bank and watch what I can do. I feel like I could do a fantastic job with this. I know I, I, know I could. Like, I don't brag very often, but I reckon with making a house and if somebody said to me, okay, this is what we want, I reckon I could do it. I don't know how to do many of the things. I would have to hire other people, but as the person, like, like with, with gaming, I would make a very good game, but I would have no idea how to make it. I'd be a brilliant game du director, but I'd have to have people making the game. I'm good at leading the thing, but not actually making it, if you sort of understand what I'm saying. I think that'll do. I think this will do. So yeah, I think that's it for this room and probably that's it for this video. So yeah, I don't know why this is a multifunctional room. <laughs> but yeah, actually, let me let me open that because that looks weird. But yeah, let me uh, get me thumbnail. Beautiful. Right, so thanks for watching, Wolf. Well, thanks, hopefully you enjoyed this video. Next time, we're gonna focus on the living room. Like, share, 
enjoy the pack today.